Hi there, lovely. I am Nicole Elisa. Welcome back to my channel. I'm an intuitive love coach for amazing women, trailblazers and leaders from all over the world, women who are committed to lead their lives with love. And today I have a special video for you. I decided to do a series of tapping sequences that are going to help you feel more beautiful, feel more confident, open up, and to love and other greater things. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and you hit that notification bell below so that you get more, you know, you get the direct notification as soon as I upload a video. I hope you enjoy this video series. As you know, my clients, um, I work with clients from all over the world, where when we work on, you know, attracting love, love starts from within. So I really help my clients really release, clear, integrate any of these stuck feelings and emotions that are in the body or in the mind. And I really help you clear them. So we do a very deep work with this. The series of videos is designed to really help you start releasing any sort of stress, um, overwhelm, frustrations that you have around this topic and start to rewire yourself for more of the love that you want. So for today's video, we are going to start with feeling beautiful. Now, I invite you to do this video until the very end. I invite you to do it however many times you need to until you feel this energy sort of coming down and bringing up um, new and amazing things for you and in your life. I would love to hear from you to see what sort of results you get from it. So as you continue to do the video, make sure you let me know in the comment section or you send me an email, the link is gonna be down below so that I know from you. I, I, would, I would love um, to, to be there for you. And if you would like deeper clearing or if you want, would love to know more about my programs, because I'm, I'm always committed to help my clients like reach that, um, like that, that end mark, you know, like have that 360 transformation. So um, I go way deeper with this in, inside of my Goddess of Love programs. So if you're interested, um, I would love to support you, okay? So we're gonna start. For those of you who, who don't know what tapping is, it, start, it's, it stands for um, EFT, Emotional Freedom um, Technique. And the way that we do is that you tap on certain meridian points in your body, where you're holding on to stress, to energy, and you're releasing it. It's kind of like acupuncture, but without the needles, basically. So the whole idea is that you follow the sequence as, as I say it, and you tap on those points to start really building up this energy from within. Now, in matters of energy, what happens sometimes is that these sort of topics can have triggers. So, as you're addressing it, you might feel tired or you might feel like you want to cry um, or you start yawning and all that is good. All of that is energy being released. So if you feel like you want to sleep afterwards or if you feel it, please know that not all people feel like they want to sleep. Some people actually feel really energized. It all depends on the energy. It all depends on the energy of the person. It all depends on where you're at. Um, some of us have this deeper than others, so keep on doing it. Others might not necessarily even feel a thing at first, but that's okay. You know, I've, I've, I've done clearings for myself where I know that I had a particular energy and there were times where I, you know, I didn't feel anything, but then there are other times where I would keep on doing it. Like I didn't feel anything like the first time or the second one, but I knew it was a topic for me. Then out of nowhere on the fifth time, I started to feel like I wanted to cry. I wanted to release a lot of energy or I felt upset or I felt really happy, but that's because I was starting to hit like the, that core point of energy or like whatever that concentrated um, energy or emotion that I had was in a moment. So it's all good. Keep on doing it however many times you need to. And um, if you would like to go deeper with other modalities that I use inside of my programs, as I'm an intuitive love coach, I can pick up on your exact energy. Because um, some of these energies, we store energies within our body. Some of us even like to hide our energies even from ourselves. Um, because we're women or you know, feminine beings, like one of the major desires of the feminine is to feel safe. So if 
we don't even feel safe with that emotion or we don't feel like we know what to do with it or we are scared of it being true, we can actually hide energy from ourselves. So working with an intuitive um, person or coach like me um, that can really point you in your, like my, my specialty is when we're doing healing work, I can pinpoint what's the energy that's showing up for you in your unconscious, in anywhere in your body. Um, and I help you release that, right? So that's, that's really, really, really valuable. And so of course, like I was going to go into Spanish, but so when you start to release these things, um, you start feeling freer, you start feeling better. Um, and any other sort of hidden emotion that is there can come up that we can actually release it. All of these things can have an impact on what we attract. So the goal, as I always like to say, we've got to clutter, we're, we're all about cluttering, um, decluttering our homes and our space, but how, how about we start decluttering what's within, okay? Um, and actually releasing it. For those of you who have spoken about topics but haven't really know how to release certain fears or things from your body or your system, doing things like this can prove to be really valuable and a total game changer for you. It's going to help you raise your love vibration, both for yourself and what you attract in your love life. Okay. So as I said today, we are going to work on the energy of, you know, feeling beautiful. I know that for me, that was like the biggest thing that, that that's always been the biggest thing. And you would be surprised of how many women don't let love in because they are scared that, um, their person might not find them attractive or they might have some resistance towards it um, due to some um, things that they saw in the past based on their relationship with their parents, okay? So today we are going to, um, we're going to start clearing that and helping you start releasing all those places where you sort of doubt yourself um, so that you can appreciate your beauty and you can love really what is there because beauty, like we all get to celebrate our beauty, all right? So I know that you've like heard a couple of noises today. It's, for some reason, I wanted to record this video and I'm, like all sorts of noises started to show. And I was like, all right, all right. I'm still going to record this. So ladies, I'm excited. So the tapping points are this. You're going to start to tap here with two fingers or more. You just tap here. You're going to tap at, uh, here at the top point of your eyebrow. The last part of it here as well. You're going to tap here underneath your eye underneath your nose, under your nose, under your lips, right? You're gonna place two fingers here, okay? And then you're gonna go two more fingers here to your left side, okay? And you're gonna tap there. And you're also gonna tap where your brow line is and at the, on the top of your head as well. You can use either um, hand or side as you want. If you grow tired, go ahead. And like I said, if you're feeling tired, if you're feeling tired, um, no, if you feel like you want to yawn, that's energy releasing. So there's no issues with that. First, I want you to think and feel into the energy of you feeling maybe not beautiful or any sort of stress that you have around your beauty. Okay. We are going to, um, I want you to, if you had to label it from a one to a 10, 10 being the highest, where is it at? So I want you to do this tapping sequence as many times as you need to until it reaches to a zero. Okay. Now, I have done this in the past where something has reached to a zero, but I've still had to do it sometimes, and that is okay. Like I said, sometimes there's like an energy underneath the energy, but just know that you're making progress, um, and it's, it's going to stick, okay? Like your body, your energy is going to start to understand it, and if there's any other remaining energy to be released, well, you will, you will know what it is, okay? Like you will, it will start to come out to you, or you can reach out to me, or you can continue to work on it. The purpose of this is that you make um, – progress, both in loving yourself and um, in attracting your ideal partner, okay? So we're going to start. Even though I've been made to feel not beautiful in my life, I deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself. Even though I've been made to doubt my beauty and compare myself with other women all of the time, I deeply and completely love, honor, and, my, and accept myself. Even though I've been made to feel ugly and I've criticized my body and my essence way too much over the years, I deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself. I've been made to question my beauty 
and my essence way too long. I notice that I'm not feeling satisfied with myself. I know I'm a beautiful person, but there are moments where I feel like my beauty is not enough. I feel like my beauty is not gonna be captivating enough to attract the real, like my real partner in life. I sometimes doubt that my beauty is going to make the difference. That my man or partner is going to be inter interested in me for the long run. I've been made to doubt that so much. I sometimes feel like it's a crippling fear. Feeling like I constantly have to work on myself. Fearing that I might lose my beauty. Fearing that a man or my partner or somebody might not find me beautiful enough. Feeling like if I attract a specific type of man or partner, then I'm gonna be beautiful enough. This is all so stressful. I feel so much stress thinking about this. Feeling like I have to compete for the attention of men or people in general. Feeling like my beauty has an impact on what I attract or I receive in life. feeling like there are other beautiful, like there are other women that are more beautiful than me. Feeling not good enough. Feeling like there's something wrong with my beauty. Feeling like there's something wrong with my skin, with my hair, with my body with my look, everything, or that thing in particular. I wanna be free because my beauty is perfect, just as it is. I might have not believed that before, but I want to. I want to be free. I want to feel better. I want to feel more confident. And I really want to release all of this fear that I have in my body, in my system, in my cells or nerves about what people are gonna think of me. It's like others have the power to determine whether I am beautiful or not. The truth is, everybody is beautiful. There's not a single person on this planet that is ugly. And I am willing to own that. I am willing to know that. I am willing to be that. I am beautiful. I am never unsafe because of my beauty. I am truly beautiful. I get to truly love every bit of who I am. I get to love my curves. I get to love my eyes. I get to love every single part of my body that I've criticized before. I am enough. I'm willing 
to love my body. I have no imperfections. I am willing to feel good about my essence. And I'm willing to love my body. I'm willing and excited to learn to nurture it from love, not from criticism. I'm willing to truly cherish my body and my essence and know that I am beautiful simply as I am. I welcome compliments and I know how to recognize projections from others. I am beautiful. I love who I am. A man or any other person has no power over me and my beauty. I no longer want to give my power away to people. I'm willing to feel beautiful and to embrace that my beauty is unique. That there's no one else like me on this planet. I am enough. I am it. And I am willing to feel good about myself no matter what. I get to stop feeling insecure about other women or about myself. And I get to truly start feeling good about who I am. If a man or a person doesn't like my beauty, that is on them. I get to love me. I get to be free. And I get to truly cherish who I am. I am perfect as I am. And I get to enjoy all seasons of me. I only get better, always and always. I glow from women because I am at peace with myself and I truly cherish who I am. I am beautiful. I love me. And I get to be loved now and forever. I feel that love now. I feel joy now. I feel my beauty now. And I'm excited to discover all sides of my beauty. I'm so grateful. I am so joyous. And I feel love now and forever. Thank you. All right, ladies, how are you feeling? I hope that you're feeling phenomenal and that you're feeling good. You're a gorgeous woman. <laughs> and um, yeah, I, I hope that you feel really good with this. Please feel free like, to share this with all of your girlfriends. You can do it together, you can do it apart. Like just share it. I would love for you to share it because you get to feel beautiful. And um, definitely make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell below because I will be uploading more tapping sequence like this. If there's any sort of specific topic that you'd like to hear from me, please let me know in the comment section or in the email that I uh, put below. And um, I'm excited to hear from you. And if you're interested in knowing how I can help you really clear these things at a deeper level, definitely reach out to me at my email or at the assessment link call below that you're going to see there, which is free. Um, all I ask is that, you know, you're serious about, you know, doing this work because there's a there's a freedom that comes with it and a peace that comes with it that I feel like as women or as feminine beings like that we all should have like well we should all have peace and um 
about who we are and love who we are. So this video applies for everybody, all right? Ladies, I hope that you're doing great. You're doing phenomenal. And thank you so much for watching. Talk to you soon.